Hi, my name is Harinaran Upadhyaya. I was born in the remote place of Nepal, called Parva district in Chua village. And it was really a very lovely place with the scenic view of Mount Machapusre and Annapurna region. Uh, actually, education at that time with us was a very difficult thing. Uh, the school were very far and I had to walk one and a half hour in the morning and one and a half hour in the evening for my education, school education. That was so difficult time. But in our time, one thing uh, very good, what I felt still now is that uh, teachers were very respectful in the society. Many society problems were solved by the teacher. I was a writer in mathematics and other subjects as well, but I liked math very much. And my mathematics teachers uh, were the role models for me. And because of that, I had chosen this career as a mathematics teacher. I established my own school, and now in my school, uh, actually I am enjoying the role as a principal in Scholar Swam Academy and the um, uh, mathematics teacher. As a mathematics teacher, I have the role to uh, promote the mathematical um, teaching, learning environment here in the school, making it joyful and child-friendly environment. I teach two periods a day, each of 75 minutes. Mathematics, both optional and compulsory mathematics. Uh, I do not teach mathematics without any material. I just do not demonstrate with the material. I provide the opportunity to uh, do the things, whatever I am demonstrating. They have to work together with me and they also make the material by themselves. And when they do, they understand better. Uh, there are so many things I have been doing for social activities in the country as a mathematics teacher. What I do every year is that I just uh, organize mathematics exhibition uh, free of cost. Can visit the stalls and they can learn the mathematical displays and the way of teaching explained by the students. What they have learned throughout the year, they are displayed in the school. And time and often, I used to do national level exhibitions also. In 2006 and in 2008, I do the national level exhibition in Kathmandu, and more than 25,000 people visited within three days. And since then, People have realized that mathematics is the subject where material can be used and teaching can be made simple using the educational material. At the same time, uh, there is not a single district left where I have not gone as a trainer. I have trained more than 40,000 mathematics teachers across the country and those teachers are applying my methods, they are appreciating that method and they have brought out the positive result and the result in school level are very high and teachers are appreciating the things, parents are appreciating the things, students are appreciating the things, and every people in the country has appreciated me. And because of that, I am awarded time and often. I am awarded with many different kinds of uh, awards related to educational development in the country. Uh, so I am satisfied with my job, what I am doing. Uh, as a social worker, I should say, uh, I am just voluntarily uh, providing training to the teacher uh, if they ask me uh, to visit their school, observe their classes, and give them feedback, I'm doing it in my free time, arranging time. I'm been there with them, and I'm helping them to promote mathematics teaching, learning environment in these schools. And now people have started thinking mathematics can be a practical subject. Previously, it was not like that. Mathematics was the game of numbers. Uh, it was something abstract working with formula and use them in particular problems, solving routine problems, something like that. But now the situation has changed. And I have uh, developed the situation like first thing is to understand the concept and second thing is to apply the concept to solve the behavioral problem, get to problem, and third thing is to create something new. Nowadays, I am in the promotion of math art, the practical uh, book in mathematics. The book with uh, mathematics manipulative in it, the book where figure dancing activities are possible, and that type of book, I am in the advocacy of that, and I am implementing that uh, as a part of my recent innovation in mathematics. There are very good reasons why I went for handheld manipulatives, teachers made manipulative, and very environmental friendly, and uh, having no health hazard, things like that. 
uh, only the use of material, no cost and low cost material, I went for that one because uh, Nepal is not very much developed and technology cannot be brought into the classroom very directly because teachers need to be trained and this school should be capable, capable to buy it and there are so many things which the country cannot offer and for that reason we have to use teacher manipulative in the classroom to make our class joyful and childhood. I have also tried to explain the message that mathematics can be an easy subject, it can be done in a very joyful and child-friendly manner, and it can be made um, uh, useful for life and future career also. And these type of things I am doing through using different kind of media like interviews in the television, talk show programs, and media coverage through newspaper, and other things They have a wide range of coverage of my activities. Uh, whatever I do throughout the country, uh, it is like that. Uh, we are still underdeveloped country, and the education system here too is very much affected by the political system of the country. Mm, practice in democracy is not in full for direction yet, and because of that, uh, the country has uh, not the very good educational policy as well. And because of that, uh, the education system here in Nepal. Uh, has not been very much effective to uh, develop the uh, necessary manpower in the country. And regarding mathematics education, most of the students do not like mathematics because of its uh, hardness and the way it is introduced to them. And the exam, how it is administered, has affected and they had a, a bad impact of mathematics in their brain. But again, we are struggling as a mathematics teacher to improve the situation. And what I am doing and trying from my side is that I am trying to uh, simplify mathematical concepts, make them easier to the students to understand and to do it uh, first understanding the concept using the manipulative materials playing with them and providing them opportunity to touch, feel and see mathematics generalize the mathematical concept by themselves and test them in their real life situation and that way I'm trying from my part to make math easier, simple and interesting to the students and I should say during this tenure of more than 40 years of teaching mathematics I have come across a lot of things, I have done a lot of things in mathematics and students are enjoying it and the government of Nepal, the public people of Nepal, the school administration and everybody appreciating because it is result oriented thing it has brought out the good result in examination it has motivated the student to study mathematics and as a trainer throughout the country voluntarily without taking any single um, penny what i am doing is that i am training the teachers of different school about new technology trend and practices going around the world in mathematics teaching. And I'm sharing my experience with them, the 40, more than 40 years of teaching mathematics experience with them. Uh, so I'm claiming that mathematics is very useful subject. Without mathematics, we cannot survive. Development is not possible without mathematics. Whatever civilizations and development we have been noticing here in this age, all these are belonging to mathematics and at the same time it can be made easy if we provide student uh, to play with manipulative materials made by the teacher and I have gone for very easiest technology because the technology what people are adopting throughout the world is not possible with us uh, because the student they are not capable of buying even the calculator we cannot expect laptop with them so because of that uh, we can just make them feel how computer works what is animation through figure dancing books something like that and that is what i have created and they play and they realize the beauty of maths and they enjoy doing math with me